Okay, here we are. We're only going to be able to do about 45 turns out of uh, the 120, is it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to load five turns onto the shuttle. Yeah, there's just not room for any. We, we have pause points at zero. Every time it comes to a complete revolution, um, you put the wire through like you see him doing now. So, so when it comes to the first pause point, that's 45 turns. So here we go. It's going. Yeah. There we go. That's good video. It, it runs great, but it just starts running out of room. So we're figuring you could theoretically do at least 45 turns and then he's going to open the shuttle and he's going to show us uh, uh, what, what you could do is actually pull the rest of the wire off and finish the coil by hand are you trying to uh, well you, yeah but if it's at pause you should be able to turn that by hand oh. motors right. should be off yeah well, it's going to be a long wire so I'm yeah. just going to use the machine yeah well I wasn't prepared for you doing that, so just we're in the video. We're just showing that you know it can be done. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right. Well, that wasn't too bad. And then you have to find the gap. It's hard to see on the shuttle. Yeah. There we go. Then he takes it out. So you could actually, you know, it would still be a time saver. There we go. How to get this to focus? So, anyways, you get probably you got like two feet of you got two feet of wire left that you could put in by hand, but it really came out nice otherwise. So, this is one of the two calls we said we could not wind. So that's not completely true. We can wind it up to the point where it gets too tight. Okay.